Who's no, 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 no? It was a lot more no's than that. <laughs> well, it is what our father used to say when Josh tried to help him do something. Are you for real? Mm -hmm. oh, I think I'm going to like him. Nobody likes him. They just fear him. What in the pop up bug? <laughs> Look, I've known y'all for seven years. Why haven't I never met your parents? Because Josh asked him not come to the dorms. He never told me that. What would he do? <laughs> White clothes. White clothes. You need to stop it now. Josh, what do you do with the white gloves? It's Trent in the building. You already know what it is. It's opposite season, y'all. From the verses. Hit it, y'all. Period. I'm out. Ooh. We might not always see eye to eye, but I know you're always by my side. And it don't matter if we're near or far. We're together now forever. And that's just who we are. structure he took the hazing too oh he smoked the hell out of me he smoked you and like a turkey like a what it's jargon being smoked means you exercise so much you have to purge your stomach I told you to purge your stomach puke fields puke fields is what they call my backyard oh wow did they make you <laughs> well not me The sweet days of yore. 0430 wake up calls, our father in the living room every morning singing his song. Uh, Get your shit and let's go home. <laughs> oh, 430, like in the morning. I think that's the call when the police is calling. Morning, PT. Oh, hold the hell on. Josh, you have me doing all that early. Marcus, morning. you have no idea what's on its way. Josh, that's a boy. Marcus, he's almost here. Okay, now what is he doing? Boot shining. Why? Something our father had us do once a week. He would sit there with a little cotton ball for hours just trying. He used every trick Uncle Anthony taught him. Melted wax, hairspray. Oh, not today, Josh, not today. What is wrong with you? There is a wrinkle in my pants. I don't see anything. Not a wrinkle. Really, Josh? A wrinkle? I might as well just be in my pajamas. Our father does hate unstarched clothing. He says wearing physical clothes makes him lazy. He would have Josh iron and starch his clothes over and over and over again. What did he used to say, Josh? Mom, what did he say to Josh? Stop it. What did he say, Josh? What did he say? Stop it, Marcus. Wrinkle in your clothes is a wrinkle in your integrity. Well, well damn. damn. Father was all about his regulations. You know, I wonder what do you think about your hair, Josh? Hey, Marcus, time to go. Let's go to work, yeah. Dress like that? Yeah, I'm for worse. You ain't never lied about that. But you might want to put on shoes. Mm. You're not going to wait to see Dad? <laughs> I love you. Bye. Why? Yeah, you got to buy a hat. OK, then we're out. Let's go. <laughs> yes, sir, Tin Hut Sergeant, sir. I hate 
hate you. I know. Oh, hi! Hippie Kibbis is down the street. Make a left, can't miss. Oh, no, I'm Fred Fields. I'm here to see Josh. Josh, your daddy's here. Hey. I like you. You know, man, I like your aura. You know, thank you. You know, we were never properly introduced. I'm Marcus. I saw you on passing a lot when I was leaving the principal's office with that guy. Handlebars. Yeah. Oh, so good to see you. Wait. Doing all right. Wait. What? What? What's happening? What's happening? Uh, Dad, you look quite um unprepossessing. What? No, I smoked that already. I'm not possessing anything, Your Honor. <laughs> huh? That's a that's a marijuana joke. <laughs> oh, come here, come here, you two. Oh God. Oh, this feels so good. Oh, it's been so long since I've seen you both. Don't mind the smell of doing the natural. Oh, oh my God. Why? Oh. Why would you? Um, I'm gonna go to work so that I won't be late. I would love to catch up. This is your God. Yes, definitely. Let's do lunch. Yes, let's call me. Love you. Love you too. She's such a good worker. Now, Josh, do you mind if I stay here a couple nights just while I'm in town? I mean, yeah, you can, but don't you want to stay at your own house? No, I want to be close to you so we can catch up. Oh, okay. I gotta go to work now. Dress like that? You don't want to put a shirt on or nothing? Damn it, Josh! Yes? Fret not about what is on the outside, for it is what is on the inside that counts. Yeah, you know, I'm usually the one, you know, trying to get you out the door so we won't be late, but if we don't leave now, we're actually going to be late. Remember, every animal and being has a right and desire for happiness. Yeah, and the itchy gitchy ya ya in you too. Let's go. Itchy gitchy ya ya ee. Uh huh. Who are you? I love that song. Whatever happened to Christina Aguilera? Hmm. You've reached Kelsey Fields. Oh no, Trevor, that's fine. Just get the chicken. I'm trying to stay away from red meat right now and get some bread. I brought food. Oh, never mind, Trevor. Thank you. My father brought lunch. Hmm. This is a nice coincidence. I didn't know you meant lunch today. Well, you know, it's been so long, I figured why waste more time, you know? It has been a year since you and Mom went on your excursion. Mm. Where is she, by the way? Is she stopping by later? Uh, you know, your mom, head in the clouds, doing her own thing, you know. We could talk about that later. How are you? How are things here? Mm, I've got my plate pretty full. I got some pending cases with some clients, some new IP forms, and... Just normal cases I can't legally talk about, and mm. I don't want to. Okay. What did you bring? Pizza. What a coincidence. Trevor and I were just gonna order pizza. Oh, Trevor. Is this, uh, someone you're dating? Did, did I interrupt a date? No. I'm so sorry if I did. Trevor is my legal assistant. He handles my front desk. Oh, I see. So are you dating anyone? No, I'm anyone? not dating No. Anyone at all? No, I'm not dating anyone. You know, I don't think you've dated anyone since, uh, since high school. What, what was the name? Dad, I am perfectly content with my life right now. Dating would just complicate things. Oh, uh, yes. Romance can be complicated. I, I understand that. You know, as long as you're happy. I you am. Know? Yeah, yeah. So, um, I was thinking this Saturday, you know, we could set aside a little bit of time. Um, know. Saturday, I think uh, I'm ready. Yeah, I just, um... I just want to talk to you and Josh about a few things, you know, no Dad, reason. what are you thinking? These are Marcus's case files. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. Let me, uh, oh, let me try to clean that up the, Dad, Dad, no. Please? Can you just go? I have a lot of work to do, and I need to order some food. Yeah. Yeah, I can, I can go. Hey, um, uh, about Saturday. I don't think I can make it.
Tommy, get in front of the ball. Mr. Fields, I'm bored. Then go run laps, play kickball. There's lacrosse sticks. There's archery in the backfield. Go try that. Can I play on my phone? No! Go play with your archery. Playing, and all they want to do is look at a four-inch screen. Sir? Oh, drop the sir shit, son. I saw whoa, yesterday. Whoa, 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 whoa. You can't see that. There's kids here. How'd you get in here anyway? Visitor pass. Who signed you? Never mind. Marcus. Marcus. Anyway, El Pollo Gringo, what's with the yellow belly chicken? With the Golden Eagles, we soar above the competition. Looks like you saw over a side biscuit with some honey. <laughs> no, we ordered some anthropomorphized eagles on the backs of these t-shirts, and somehow mine, and only mine, came back like this. <laughs> it's a huge mystery. <laughs> Saturday. This Saturday? Yes. I don't know. Vicky, don't you eat that booger. Don't you eat. Oh, she just ate. How am I supposed to respond to that? She just ate another kid's booger. I'm going to have to get back to you on Saturday. Vicky, get over to the bench. Yeah, you got work to do. I'll, uh, I'll see you at home. What? Busy day? Oh, yeah. Well, you're home now. Time to relax. Relax? Do you know who's in there? Your dad? Man, where are your handles? There are no handles in this car. You squabbed me for life, Josh. You happy? Dude, just push the button. Pu <sighs> We're locked in the car. Push the button. Bye, Josh. Man, you're making me feel like I'm bad at this. You're not bad for a novice, but I'm still gonna kick yo ass. Good game. Good game. Good game. Good game. Good game. Hey, you wanna get in on this? Nah, not today. I'm good. <laughs> really, Marcus? You too? What? You said no. Josh. Hey, Josh. What's up? So, about this weekend. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. I can't. Oh, okay. Well, why? Um, <clears throat> I'm in charge of the school's study program, and there's a lot of kids falling behind. Oh, okay. right. Uh, well, um, I'm going to stick around for a few days, huh? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to go take some time, all right? All right. Well, um, we will figure it out. Yeah, Dad. We'll, uh, we'll figure it out. Yeah. Hey! How's this game go? Uh, Mark cheated. No, I'm not. Come on! Marcus? Sergeant Fields? Dad? Oh man, that shit was wild. Ooh. What shit was wild? <laughs> you ain't lying. I ain't had that much fun since. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't had that much fun a long time either. Really, Marcus? What? You said you had to work, and he asked you first. <laughs> it was. You too? You did, right? You too. I'm gonna go pass this up. <laughs> no shirt? Got the PJ. Yeah, about that. We really didn't know where the cabin was at, you know. <laughs> but, uh, good memories. Yeah. Where's Anthony? Oh, well, he was talking to the press lady, said she had to be this tall to ride, and I think she took him up on the off. Actually, he's still there. Good for him. <laughs> hey. Hey, uh, we're about to uh, play Smash. Gonna start turning. Wanna play? Not today, man. Sit yourself up. I'll take first. 
hey, 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 Josh, uh, you want to hang out one of these days? When you're free. Yeah, let me check my calendar. Okay? Hey, all right. <laughs> all right, guys, get ready because I'm about to smash your asses. <laughs> Excuse me? What? What did I say? What was said was you about to smash some asses? Oh, all right, all right. I get it. Y'all talking about that booty bump? You know that reminds me of a story. One time whoa, I was in South America. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, 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 no. Please do tell. Okay, so me and two of them after that, so technically it's a five. Man, let me tell you. <laughs> Down for 30 seconds on a tree. <laughs> what do you call that again? Koalify. <laughs> <laughs> hey, son. <laughs> hey, Josh, you were breastfed till you were 12? You told him? <laughs> what? You're not supposed to tell anybody. You promise you want to tell anybody. I'm going to tell mom. Hey, I didn't raise no snitch. <laughs> oh, what? oh, you going to cry? Oh, he's probably going to cry. <laughs> you know the boy went to bed until he was 16. <laughs> Cheers. Plastic sheets. Plastic sheets. My car, my car is gone. What's happening? Grand Theft Auto was real. Call the CIA. Call 911. Call it's the FBI. Call the government. Oil change. I took your car to get an oil change. So we can go get it together. I don't want to go get it together. I'm sorry. That's not what I meant. That came out wrong. What I mean is, I need some space. We need some space from you. Your car is at the hard mechanic on the corner. I'll just get a hotel. <laughs> Kelsey, will you take me to get my car? Yeah. What happened? I think I said the wrong things again. No idea where you came. We've checked everything. Where? Oh, so glad to see both of you. Now you listen close. And, and you, you listen, listen good. good. That's right, it's mm -hmm. Now I was about to read you like a Sunday morning, wrapped up in a blanket in the snowy mountains, sitting next to a warm fire with the next romance of Rebecca Stone. But since I've been dealing with Russell all day, I do not have the voice. But I want to say this. I'm very disappointed in you two. As you should be. That's right. Right? Mm hmm We've been acting a little off lately, and it's something that we need to work on with our father. Are you serious? What in the subtle awareness? I'll be back in the morning before I get the bags. Good night. Good night, guys. That, that went well. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right. I'll get to you. No, no, you read them well. Like, like, like a book club theater. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we're strong, strong. Okay. Yeah, weather, yeah. weather. Storm's coming. Swoosh. Yeah. 
morning. Good morning. Morning. I just came to get my bag. I'll be out of your hair shortly. Give me just like one, one minute. All right. Go oh, ahead, fellas. Hey, it's very nice. Hello. I'll see you later. All right. Hey, um, listen, it's been a pleasure seeing you two uh, while I could, and I was hoping to have a little bit more time to catch up, talk. About that. We feel really bad for how we've been treating you. We've just been really different. It's been a real adjustment. And it's not an excuse. We're both sorry. Well, thank you. Truly. Is there any time that we can get together and talk? Just need a time and a place, and we'll be there. You don't really mean that? Yes. She's the boss. Well, I was hoping that we'd go camping. Camping? <laughs> yeah, camping. I'm so down. I'm there. Okay. Hey, all right. Hey, fellas, they're going camping with us. Sounds exciting. That's what I'm talking about. Horse? Yeah. Somebody say camping? Mm-hmm. Dude, we don't have work for like three hours. Dude, coffee. It's never for some people. They say the truck. We're going camping. Go ahead, boy. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, this is gonna be fun. <laughs> oh, good. S'mores. S'mores. S'mores blue. S'mores blue. We might not always see eye to eye, but I know you're always by my side, and it don't matter. Just